Mark, uh, these first few days of the Clinton campaign have seen her trying to perform a balancing act with the left and the center, quite obviously. How do you think that is going for her so far? I don't think it's going well. My, my supposition is she's so terrified of losing Iowa, and she's so terrified that even if she wins the Iowa caucuses, but some liberal does well enough to wound her that it will hurt her chances, that she's forgetting the fact that there's a general election to come if she's a nominee. She's, she's a terrified of the left, and it's showing on a range of issues. Wall Street won't hold her accountable to it, but she, I think, is creating a lot of trouble for herself, and it's only just begun. Well, I'll say this is true, uh, which is that the left is never going to be fully satisfied by almost anything she does. Does She will never be Elizabeth Warren. She can write all the essays she wants about how great Elizabeth Warren is in Time magazine, and she's never going to be that. But I think she has not moved far. We don't have, there's not enough policy out there yet to really have her to have damaged herself. She's had some rhetorical flourishes, but she's not putting anything on paper right now that, is, that will actually damage her yet in the general election. Well, I don't think it's damaged her. I mean, she, she seems to have moved a little bit to the left on same-sex marriage. But my sense is from the way she's talking, from the way her campaign is responding to some things and not others, she's terrified of the left. Their demands will never end. And if she continues to cater to them, that's where the energy is in the party. I understand the impulse. You see Republicans doing it all the time. But it's going to hurt her chances of winning the general and looking like someone like her husband who ran with the same message in the nomination fight as she wants to run on in the general if she's a nominee. Well, look, I think her theory of the case, though, Mark, is that she's not going to need, this is not going to be an election about, we'll see whether this turns out to be true, but this isn't going to be an election about persuading the center, which is what her husband had to do back in the 90s. This is going to be an, an election about mobilizing the coalition of the ascendant, getting Barack Obama's people on board, getting them enthused, turning them out. And for that, she's going to need to make some gestures to the left. And she is more liberal on economics than her husband is. And so I don't think she's necessarily not being true to herself in the things she's saying so far. I agree with that. But the whole mood music of this is respond to the left. And I just don't think that's a, a good long-term strategy.